Happy Christmas, everyone. Yes, it's Christmas Day, 2018. And no, I am not in my shed on Christmas Day. <laughs> but I am. I just want to put up a quick project for you today. Um, I know you've probably all got family and friends over and the last thing you want to be doing is watching me. But, just in case you kind of got bored for a few minutes and you thought to yourself, well, I'll sit down and watch a bit of YouTube. Did you like my app? <laughs> I know for some of you it's probably not even Christmas Day yet. Or, for some of others, Christmas Day is almost over. But for us in the UK, it's just starting. Well, we probably got up around about, I don't know, about half six. And it's straight downstairs to open the presents. Well, that's if Santa left us any, of course. But we've all been pretty good this year, so I'm hoping he did. Okay, on to the project. If this is going to work out, I don't know. But let's give it a bash.
Happy Christmas! <laughs> there it is, folks. I uh, hope you like it. Um, it was just a little quick uh, project that maybe you guys can try at home over the Christmas holidays. I chose to use exotic uh, woods in this because I kind of like Christmas <laughs> and I like exotic wood, obviously. Uh, but you can use any bits of wood. You could use pen blanks, cut them up. You could use pallet wood, cut that up. But um, anything really, and I thought that was kind of a funky looking Christmas tree. What do you reckon? Burnt my little emblem in the bottom there. Um, and yeah, that would make quite a nice little piece on my mantel shelf. Even though I don't have a mantel shelf. You can obviously move it about a bit uh, if you want, you know, because obviously these bits move so you can get the kind of like the look that you want. Yeah, I don't know which way looks better really. But um, either way, it's definitely a better Christmas tree than the one I made a few weeks back. I think you'll agree. <laughs> well, I hope you do. So there it is, folks. My little Christmas project for you guys. Want to get something up on Christmas Day. Hope you get a chance to watch it. Uh, if not, then Boxing Day's fine. Do they do Boxing Day in the States? Basically, if not, that's the day after Christmas. I really appreciate all the support I've had this year for my channel, and I can't thank you guys enough for commenting, sticking with me, uh, liking. Oh, I don't mind some of the dislikes. Now and again. And just generally supporting me and this channel, I really do. I'm really quite overwhelmed and I just can't believe it. So thank you, you, so much for your support. Um, hopefully I can come up with some really funky projects next year. Um, there may well be a project before the end of the year, I don't know. Actually, no, I think there is one, actually. Yeah, there is one. Um, but I've got loads of ideas in my head. But keep chucking over those ideas because I really do need your uh, input as well on some of these things. And that really does help me out. Don't forget to check out all the links in the description. My PO box is in there if you fancy sending me anything. And there's loads of links in there that I put in there to help you guys out. Don't forget to check out my Instagram. Take care, guys. Have a fantastic holiday, Christmas break. Go and watch Back to the Future or something Christmassy. That could be Clash of the Titans or Santa Claus the movie, Superman, Star Wars. What about Elf? Why are you smiling like that? I just like to smile. Smiling's my favorite. How everybody loves Elf. Christmas with the Cranks. What about the new Christmas Chronicles on Netflix? That is really good. Check it out. <laughs> Happy Christmas.